another Black History moment in the virtual fast for the filing event for seniors tonight. All today on. Hello, my name is Doreen Hill. It's a busy time for seniors, so let's get another senior moments with Mrs. Porter. Welcome to Senior Moments with Mrs. Porter. Seniors, we have not talked about the FAFSA in a few weeks. Just a reminder that if you are planning to attend college next year, you must complete a FAFSA to see if you're eligible for any financial aid to help you pay for your college. And also, if you're a 21st century scholar, it is required for you to complete a FAFSA to receive your scholarship. So please, you need to do your FAFSA. The Indiana Commission of Higher Education is hosting an, a regional event this evening, um, February the 10th at 5.30 p.m. Seniors and parents, you can join this meeting by Zoom um, and uh, you can receive assistance on completing your FAFSA, how to set up your FAFSA ID number and help you understand your financial aid package once you have completed it and received it. This is all very important information for you. The meeting link and the password is posted for students in the Canvas student calendar on your Canvas um, page. If you have not completed your FAFSA, please consider attending this Zoom meeting. It will be very helpful and it's just really nice to get your FAFSA done. That's one of those things you can check off your senior list that you have completed. Contact me or your counselor if you have questions. Also, if you have not been in yet to pick up your honors and awards scholarship information and application, please do that this week. I'll see you next week for more Senior Moments with Mrs. Porter. Thank you. Now on to the rest of the announcements. And seniors, if you missed the virtual session tonight, there will be another virtual FAFSA filing event on Sunday, March 7th. For more information, just check out collegegoalsunday.org. Also, Herb Jones will be here tomorrow and Friday during lunch for seniors to order caps, gowns, and other graduation items. Seniors, make sure to stop by and see them. Remember, if you'd like to participate in the RHS Gay Straight Alliance, then stop by and talk with Ms. Hartman in room 146. And you can make a difference and help save the environment by participating in the RHS Green Cup. See Ms. Carpenter to find out more in room 315. On Friday, we'll be sharing our President's Day virtual assembly with you. So we're going to share this week's Black History moment with you today. Stagecoach Mary, they call her, but her name was Mary Fields, born a slave. Mary was freed after the Civil War and eventually found her way to Cascade, Montana, where she liked guns, smoking, and drinking hard liquor. She was known to be as tough as any man and eventually found her way into being a stagecoach driver, delivering and protecting the mail. That made her the first ever African-American woman to be a star route mail carrier. She never missed a day of driving her route carrying a pistol and a rifle, even though she was in her 60s. She drove the route for eight years before retiring at age 71 in 1903. She became so popular in Cascade that the town closed their schools to celebrate her birthday every year. And we celebrate Mary today with this Black History Moment. That's our show, but before we go, we want to congratulate both the girls and the boys Archers bowling teams who won their sectional championships over the weekend. Both teams now move on to the regional at Newcastle this Saturday. So those are your announcements. My name is Dorian Neal. Have a great day.